Japanese sprint sensation Lord Kanaloa returns to one of his favourite racing stages to retain his Longines Hong Kong sprint title. The five-year-old powerhouse is no stranger to winning major races back-to-back. -back. In September, he won the Sprinters Stakes at Nakayama for the second consecutive year. Starting a prohibitive favourite, it was his fifth straight Group 1 victory and it saw him become only the second horse since 1998 Japanese Horse of the Year Taiki Shuttle to win five in a row at this top level. Fifty metres to run. Here comes Lord Kanaloa getting busy. Is it Haksan Moon kicks Lord Kanaloa? Haksan Moon. Lord Kanaloa beats Haksan Moon. Fortunately for his many fans in Hong Kong, that impressive win staved off any plans his owners might have had to retire him to start. So now that top-class racing competition remains on his agenda, his next mission is to win another Longines Hong Kong Sprint. And as only could be expected, he faces an ominous set of rivals. The son of King Kamehameha shares the equal highest rating in the field with local star Lucky Nine. The pair met in the 2012 edition of the Longines Hong Kong Sprint with Lucky Nine finishing fifth. And the Japanese sprinter Lord Kaloa draws level with Cerise Cherry, then Captain Sweet. Lucky Nine can't get there, but Lord Kaloa sprints away and it's Japan's first victory in the Hong Kong Sprint. Lord Kaloa. The winning performance of Lord Kaloa last year at Cha Tin was in the better than standard time of a minute 8.5 seconds for the 1200 metre journey. With 12 wins from 18 starts so far, Lord Kanaloa has become the pin-up sprinter not only of Asia, but right across the racing globe, he's lauded for his amazing feats on the racetrack. Local victories on Hong Kong's International Day usually receive the loudest cheers and applause from the tens of thousands in attendance. And whilst Lord Kanaloa might not be flying the Bohemia flag, he can be assured of an equally high level of celebration if he crosses the line first, such is his popularity in this part of the world.